Hi guys, it's Cindy with Pups and Crochet. Okay, I'm just popping on for a few minutes before I go and walk Peanut. I got a couple of announcements, then I have a surprise for you. So make sure you listen, stay tuned, and yay. Okay, first couple announcements. First, all right, Laura with Laura's Yarn Talk, and also Grammy Colleen Crochet, Colleen with that, are doing a race, a hashtag, race to 500 friends. So the first, they're, uh, <laughs> I can't speak today. I don't know why. Okay, so let's do this again. Colleen with Grammy Colleen's Crochet and Laura with Laura's Yarn Talk are together doing hashtag race to 500 friends. Everybody's trying to get their community tab and everybody should be able to get their community tab and that is what this is for. They are each offering a prize and they are both in my community tab. You can look and get both of their their uh, links and go right on their videos for it. Okay, and then also too, they're also offering if people wanna join in and do it too. And whoever gets to 500 first picks a winner and then they get the prizes. So it's gonna be one winner with the prizes from both of them unless more people join in. So if you wanna join in and do that and be on their hashtag, just let them know and they will show you what to do to put your video up. You can check out both of their channels, enter their videos and have fun and play. And so this is for community tips to get more family members on their channel to get it. And I think it's an awesome idea. So I hope you guys will all join in. I'll try to remember to link both of their links under this video, but in case I do forget, it's in my community tab. Just so you know. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Also, I wanted to tell you um, to all my fellow fairies, I am getting around to visiting everybody's channel to say hi and then I'm flying by with my crooked wings. If I haven't been there, I'm getting there. There's <laughs> quite a few to get through and I, I'm running out of time to do all this stuff. I'm like, oh man. And I hope that you guys um, enjoyed the Yarnaholics yesterday. Connie wasn't feeling well, and we're hoping that she feels better. Her back is hurting. So she wasn't with us yesterday. But it's okay. We showed her down. And also, just so you know, my little tango that I put a short on, it's on my video thing. It's a little short of her. I took out some yarn and was playing with her. And... I gotta make her some little cat toys. I don't know. I'd never had a cat. Don't know much about cats. But last night at like midnight, one o'clock in the morning, I went outside and she boop, popped in and jumped inside and Peanut went bonkers. But luckily I picked her up and I took her back outside with me so he didn't get her. <laughs> but she wants to come in. And my Sadie says she, that she thinks I should let her come in and let her and Peanut get used to each other. And I'm like, Sadie, I've never had a cat. I don't know what to do with a cat. And she goes, cats are the most easiest thing to take care of ever. I'm like, I also have a bird and she's out flying. What if she eats her? Or what if I wake up one day and she brings, because people have told me that they bring you presents, like dead mice and stuff like that. So anyway, I need to find a mommy home for her. She needs a forever home. And I gotta find her one. Because I don't know if Peanut's gonna like it very much. Because now she's following us on our walks. And every time I turn around, I see her duck down. She's in the grass. And she army crawls. And, and then Peanut sees her. And then Peanut goes crazy. Then I can't get him to go to the bathroom. Because she's too busy watching her. Okay. So, I don't want to make this long video. So, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you why I'm on here. Because it's giveaway time, giveaway time, giveaway time. Yes, I am catching up because we are behind. 
we did not do our 800 giveaway because I was busy with the fairies and my yarnivores doing our boho project, my fi the five yarnaholics that I'm with, and then joining in on different things, trying to help everybody with their stuff. So I got behind. So we are going to do it. Robert packed this up. So I'm going to show you, I haven't looked, so I'm going to show you what he packed up for this one. And then we have to work, hopefully, on our next one. So let's see, okay? Okay, so first you put in one of these holders. You put the pegs in and stand up, and this makes an awesome, it's for paintbrushes, but it makes it awesome for your needles to go in. And then you just kind of like spin it around and then you get your needle but it's got a lot of spaces in there for it 49 holes so you can put 49 needles in here crochet needles because i do have one so okay then you put in a blade five millimeter hook oh uh, and you get a project bag. Sorry, he yeah, had pulled it up. So it's a project bag with little seashells on it. And it's blue. All right. Now let's see. Ah, so that's where that went. You put the little kitty tape measure. Let's see what else he's got here. Ah. Okay, he put two of these Serenity Chunkies. They're 100% acrylic, 109 yards. And they're in the color almond. So you get two. And they're a bulky five. Okay, then this one's called Wishing Well. It's a number four, and there's 426 yards of this, and it's Mandela Tweed Stripes. Yellow pretty colors. Oh, he's doing pretty good. Let's see, get that. And then last but not least, you get a, another Mandela Tweed Striped. Same yardage, everything. But this one is called Horseshoe. So you get a lot of yardage in these. And it's all browns and grays and blues and really pretty colors. And that's how it works up. And then that's how this one works up. Okay, so what do you have to do to get into this giveaway for our 800 family members? Okay, what I want you to put in the word tango the name i named the cat outside tango i haven't seen stash but tango t-a-n-g-o all in big letters not little letters big letters capital letters t-a-n-g-o okay and that is what i would like you to do Make sure it's in your comment so that when I put it through the random comment picker, we will be able to pick a winner and I won't have to pick again if it's not in there. And it will be put in the specific text the way that it should be. So, please listen to it and do that. And you can win this beautiful box that Robert packed up for our 800 just to appreciate you for being part of our pups and crochet family so i will wish you well sending you hugs and puppy kisses and prayers if you need them and connie i hope you do feel better and neva's off on a vacation and she's having so much fun and i got a bird whispering over me yeah he snuck downstairs he snuck downstairs while I'm doing the video. How rude. How rude. 
Okay, now, this, now I lost my track. You made me lose my track now. Okay, here's, here's the thing, the dealio, okay? Here's the dealio. So, make sure, this is going to be quick. We are going to be picking, today is what, Monday? I am going to give you till Wednesday. Two days, we're just going to run this. I will pick this on thir the winner on Thursday mid-morning, somewhere around there. Okay? Two days. So you have, well, two and a half days. You got the rest of today, tomorrow, and then Wednesday. And I will pick on Thursday morning. Okay. So we're going to do a quickie. Yeah, it's a quickie. <laughs> okay. So... Hugs and puppy kisses, prayers if you need them. Remember, adopt, don't shop. There are way too many babies that are out there. And trust me, I know, because Tango just brought another one. There are so many babies out there, I'm going to have to catch them. So, remember, adopt, don't shop. There are so many waiting in your humane society, your rescue groups, anything. And please, before you do, make sure you check to see what type of dog you want. Okay, what's gonna work best for you? Don't have a Great Dane and you have two feet of yard. That's not gonna work. They will tear your house up. Just like if you have a hundred mile fields and you only get one Chihuahua, he's gonna get lost. So, and if you don't like barkers, you might not want a chihuahua. If you don't want a howler, you might not want a hound dog or a beagle because they do howl. And even Peanut's starting to howl now because he's jealous over the cat. I can't say the word out loud because he goes crazy. So I have to say C-A-T. Okay, so. <laughs> she got in my house last night. I got her. And when I went back out with her, he sat by the back door and he was just going, oh, because he was so jealous. And now she's following us because she's jealous. So I, I'm in the middle here. So any advice would be helpful. And I'm trying to make some cat toys for her because she really likes the string. But she ended up catching the top of my foot a couple times with the string. And man, they're, they're sharp. They're really sharp. I had to put peroxide on it. I'm like, dang, that hurt. Okay, <laughs> but I will let you go. And please make sure you check out the race to 500 friends. The hashtag race to 500 friends with Grammy, Colleen, Crochet, and Laura Yarn Talk. And I will try to remember to post everything so that you can find it. If not, it's always in my community tab. Plus, I have some other things in my community tab that these people need a little love. Their channels need some love. Check them out and see. So, I will let you go. Have a great week. And I will see you soon. Bye.